Well, hello everyone, it's Rose, and I'm back with another little unbagging. I thought I was done for um, with my videos for today, but this was in my mailbox when I got back from walking the dog. And so I wanted to open it up and just show you uh, what it is and what I'm gonna use it for. So I got this from the Hankins Painting Store. And, um, oh, okay, it's super well taped. All right, let's just cut through all this bubble wrap. Goodness gracious. Okay, there we go. That's it. All right, so it's just a little thing in here. More tape. during the 11.11 sale was I bought a, t uh, a roll of one half centimeter double-sided tape. So this is our diamond painting adhesive that we find on canvases like this. So I bought this uh, during the 11.11 sale. Now I paid, um, this is Canadian dollars that I'm quoting at you, for uh, five dollars and eighteen cents plus a dollar eighty one shipping for this, um, and I got a forty four dollar uh, a forty four cent store coupon. So the total purchase price for this after a coupon was was six dollars and fifty five cents, which I think is fine for something that's going to last me probably forever, um, because I don't need it very often. But when I need it, I need it. And the fact that I got the super thin one, I usually only need just a very thin piece. Um, you can buy a roll of double-sided tape at Staples or Walmart or anywhere else. That's fine. If you want to do that, do that. But I just thought I'd get this. What the heck? Um, because then I won't have to, you know, cut it down the middle kind of thing. I bought it because there have been times that I've bought diamond paintings that have had just, that the paper has not extended right to the edge of the diamond painting and so I'm going to need a little bit of um, adhesive or what I did today um, I always put stickers well now I put stickers I used to write on them with magic marker but I always uh, put stickers that uh, gives me my item number that's my personal like the number of the diamond painting uh, that I bought um, the name that I've given it the dimensions, whether it's square or round, and the store or the, um, the, the seller that I got it from. Sometimes I just say AliExpress, uh, but lately I've been saying more. Anyway, the label extended down into the first row of uh, drills, and I, I did remove that, um, but it's left that that first row of drills not very sticky. So I'm just going to try this. I think I need it. Well, I'm going to cut a piece first. Let's see, how long a piece do I need? I need a piece that's that long. Oops. back on there like so there we go and now I have my little piece of diamond painting double-sided tape which you could also use for um, gift wrap to make sure that uh, the tape on your packages doesn't show that was actually one of the things that I was thinking that I could use it for because that's an awful lot of tape and then you just pull it back and even though there's two layers of tape over some of these drills, it's still, I'm going to turn on the flash so you can see, it's still perfectly clear. I can see where the tape is. Uh, and there, ta-da, problem solved. And now I have a fully sticky canvas again. Now I could also use this 
if um, for any reason I ever did something to a diamond painting that made it unsticky. Um, there was a video that Diggy415 did uh, some time ago about um, she was doing like a, something for firefighters in her uh, neighborhood and um, and uh, she spilled something on her canvas and so it made the glue kind of goopy, uh, the adhesive kind of goopy. Well, you could scrape the adhesive off and stick a few or a lot, I can't remember how big a size it was, but um, you could stick some of this on there. So this is 5,000 centimeters. So this is 50 meters of diamond painting tape, essentially, double-sided tape, uh, which is a lot of tape. Um, I'll probably never use it all. That's fine, I've got it. And I think what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to keep this in here. I'll just uh, retape it. And uh, this will be the container that I use for it. And um, yeah, Bob's your uncle. That'll sort of keep it from getting all wonky because uh, it is it is quite, I think it would be easy in a drawer full of other stuff for uh, you know the center to come out and then you're talking, anyway, could get messy. So I'll just keep it in here. There we go. And that's it, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing to my channel, and come back and visit with me again soon.